So I did a short video the other day talking about um, basically having a bit of a moan, really, about um, some flaws in the log output, the V-log output from the Panasonic. And I showed an example of the banding, but I didn't show an example of the macro blocking, and I felt bad about that, so I thought I'd better come back and actually give you an example of what I'm talking about, because I think an example not only clearly shows you exactly what I mean, um, but also hopefully will make someone think, oh, I know what causes that, and kind of might you someone might come back and actually tell me how I can fix it or what I'm doing wrong. Uh, so here's some some test footage I did earlier on, and if you just keep I've pre-rendered this actually, just which is why it's all in green here, be so that um, it plays back clearly, uh, even with the <clears throat> even with the rent uh, the uh, effects on the grading on. So it's a log file originally. That's what it looks like originally, and it's a pretty hefty grade. And if you just take a look at the round the cheek area here, as it plays there, hopefully you'll be able to see this. I'm not sure how well this will encode in YouTube, but you'll see a kind of shimmering effect. So that's playing at 100%, so there's no, no magnification on that at all. So if we just zoom into 400%, so you can see this a bit more clearly, you see exactly what I was talking about the other day. So here, you can see that we've got kind of square blocks around where the, where you've got that sort of change in tone uh, between one part of uh, his skin and another part of his skin. And if I can get this to fit in the window, it doesn't fit in the window very well. Uh, but there we go. And you can see what's happening there. I'm sort of shifting it around. And we've basically got this horrible shimmer. I mean, that, that paused frame there is a great one, because look, we've got actual blocks here. This only happens on vlog output. I haven't seen anything similar from the scene profiles. And uh, I just think it looks really weird. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't have thought that... I, I mean, I know there are downsides to using it as well as upsides, but I mean, that's just really poor. That's, you know, it almost makes it completely unusable, having a kind of shimmer in, in the face. I mean, you don't watch your footage at 400%, admittedly, but you do watch it at 100%. And I actually wouldn't probably grade it like this either, but uh, if you take a look there, this area here, I'll just sort of highlight it. Anyway, there you go, yeah, so that's the macro blocking uh, with the VLOG-L output to the internal codec, 420 8-bit codec.